them on 60. I honestly thought I was seeing things. And also the the seeing Jesus what got me, believe it or not. <laughs> I watched one of Curtis's videos and I started liking those seeing Jesus. But I don't like them as much as most people do. Well, I don't like I, I don't know. They, they, to me, they tend to be more, uh, uh, now I'm not going to say cleaner. Um, there's something about them that sets itself different than the diesels, of course. Oh, yeah. But I just don't like the fact when they're making a turn run, the whole bus banks yeah. really hard. And then you got all the weight on top of it. That's you know? true. If you've ever been on one of those buses making a turn, you've got some drivers that can care less if he flips it. You're going to think you're going to flip over. But fine, I'll go one better. RTS CNG oh. that Triborough used to have. Mm -hmm. I thought if any bus would flip over, it would have been them. That's what, that's what I thought them too. Them buses were sick. The way they sounded, I oh, oh man. I, I, I remember those. And then they had the ones that command. Those were my favorites. Well, I think those are better, even though those are the same type. But... The ones that Command actually sounded really, really good. The I Command had the classics and the RTSs out. <coughs> command to me was in Command. Classics and RTSs. Yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. Yeah, you got my vote. Although we never had an RTS. If you come to my depot one day and look in our depot, you'll understand why we are fitted to natural gas. We got these huge fucking tanks in the back. Huge! Our gas station looks like a gas station. It's like Exxon or some shit. <laughs> it's got the roof with the lights and... and LaGuardia used to have, I think LaGuardia CNG's, uh, their station blew up, didn't it? Yeah, we, we were there when it happened, so. Oh, shit, really? Yeah, they were from, from, and it was good to have somebody that worked in there just I knew all the info. They tried to blame it on a mechanic that just, you know, hated the company, mm -hmm. but it really wasn't him. And, you know, it's just rumors, left and right, you know, nobody knew, nobody knew what to think about it. That depot, I don't know how it's doing now, but it's not that, my, my boy doesn't work in any worse than Yonkers. So I don't get the, I don't get the info that I need. If your boy works in Yonkers, he probably got your 30 99 now. He does. He, he does? He sends me pics of it getting washed and holding it down and, you know. <laughs> and when he walks in, he's like, it still smells like me because I used to keep my little trees. There. Mm -hmm. All my cell phone stickers are still in there. Huh. I used to sabotage all the time. I ain't gonna lie. When you knew it was my bus, you knew it. There's just little things that I did to it. I would put cell phone dog, that cell phone sticker, just the phone part. Mm -hmm. I would take that sticker, I would put it all the way towards the roof in the back of the bus on the top. <laughs> as far as I could reach. So yeah, I know who's bus that is. What was the back line? Back line the other day, he comes to me, I saw 30 days gone on Fifth Avenue. <laughs> it ain't yours no more. You probably got, you probably got excited. I, I ain't even gonna lie to you. That, it's not that it's just, of course it's MTA property, but I've, I've had a bus for almost three years. You're talking about having a bus that you get day in, afternoon out, almost three years. Mm -hmm. You tend to start to think that it is yours. You know, that's a long time. Mm -hmm. Nah, a lot of guys I used to be mad at because like, whose dick are you sucking? Fuck <laughs> you! <laughs> you know? It's just that I feel if you're nice to um, the inspectors and you're cool with them. Mm -hmm. You know, um, call it favorites and call it what you want, but the one thing for sure, you don't want to be on nobody's bad side. Yeah, that's true. And you know, it's good that you have actually somebody in your family that's in that particular position, because you 
would understand where I'm coming from. Yep. When you're on somebody's bad side, then that person is going to talk about you and you're not liked. Mm -hmm. Not only are you not liked, you're going to get fucked. That's true. You know, so, trust me, yeah. Anyway, hey, Curtis. Mm -hmm. How was that nap, man? <laughs> We, yeah, have, we haven't heard from you. Yeah, we haven't heard. Because when he was at the um, he had a real conversion. I was going to go to the FDR. That's when you fell out? No, I was, <laughs> no, I fell out when you were um, by the Brooklyn Valley Tunnel thing, Queens Midtown Tunnel. Uh, yeah, I kind of got that effect on people. I'm still trying to find that with you know nobody on and one smooth chick and trying to put her to sleep. Oh man. You slip right in that pan. How you do it. Jesus Christ. I swear I'm not fucking winning today, man. I've had a better day. I won't win it for the Marco Polo. <laughs> Midtown tunnel approaches and looks a little packed right now. Everything's packed. Everything's fucking packed. The bridge, if you get the bridge, you might as well be lucky. I'm not going to the bridge. I saw, I saw it when we was coming in. Oh. When I turned on the BQE, uh -huh. it was all backed up. This little bit of traffic might be the reason. That's how you know. When the BQE's backed up, this backs up. Mm -hmm. So you pass the BQE. 